hello guys welcome back to another video and in this video i will show you how to download and install android emulator manually without having to download it from here because the reason you know the downloader uh, which is provided by android studio is weak especially for those who are having a slow internet connection like me right now uh, i have tried to download this image file multiple times and it goes even to 60% and it got cancelled and again I tried again and again it started from zero and it got me mad so I decided to find a way to uh, download it and install it uh, manually because I have a speed download manager I can download anything without have, uh, having any problem so before we start the video i just wanted you guys if you like the video don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for future videos and also write down your comments in the comment section so let's get started with a video you can download any image that you want just click the download here and from here the link for the download will appear just Control c for copy and go to your browser Control V and enter, it will download using download manager, any download manager that you have. Uh, just uh, finish that download and come to here now. Now we are done with this, I will cancel this because we no longer need that. And uh, then uh, my download is here, as you can see I have downloaded that image already, so I have it in my desktop. I will just extract this same thing into this directory you just have to keep an keep your eye in the directory that I'm going because uh, you you may go to the wrong directory just follow the steps right like me go to your username and from here find the app data then local inside here go to Android SDK you just have to find your SDK wherever it is Android SDK that inside that you have to find system images inside system images you will find an android dash 30 just uh, whatever it is uh, I had this one so go inside that and uh, inside the Google Google API's so just uh, come here and extract it inside this one All right, once the extraction has been done, then you have to come to your Android Studio and close this one. Just uh, come to your Android Studio, close your Android Studio, exit, fully exit from your Android Studio, close everything that you are, open your Android Studio again, and you will see that Android emulator without having to download it again. Just let's, let me prove it for you. So here we are with the Android Studio again and I will go to Android Virtual Device, create a virtual device, I like this 3A, next. Now you will see that in uh, x86 images I will have that image already downloaded, I can select that and click on next. As you can see before it was not downloaded now I don't have to download this just click no next and uh, customize your settings and you're done with this just you can do finish and uh, now we are ready to start our Android emulator ADB it says what already running it is already started no issues Okay, Vanguard. And that's it, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like, and I will see you in the next video. And also provide me some feedback. How is this new method? Thank you.